Hi and welcome. In this video, we will see how you can send a mail from your Ignition Scada project. Okay, and your project can be either um, Vision Client project or Perspective Client project. Okay, so to send the mail from Ignition Scada, you have to follow some steps like you have to do some configuration in Gateway, and then after you have to write some scripting uh, behind the buttons to send the mail when you press the button. Okay, so we will see how you can do that and what scripting you have to write to send the mail okay so first of all we will open our browser and go to ignition scada gateway homepage, and then after in config section we will find the networking section and then here we have email setting okay we have to make some email profile in email setting so we will go to email setting and as you can see here outlook email profile which already i have created to send the mail from my outlook account okay now if you want to check what configuration you have to done in your profile then you can see on our website that you first have to go to config section and then you have to go to email setting after that you have to enter the profile name and if you are sending mail from your outlook account then you have to use host name and port like smtp-mail.outlook.com and port as a 587 and you have to use start tls and then after you have to enter your username username is like from which email address you want to send the mail to a, another user okay and then after you have to change your password or you have to enter your password and then you have to save the changes okay so we will go to edit to see our settings so this is my email profile name and the main part is smtp server setting okay so host name for outlook is smtp-mail.outlook.com this is the port number you have to enable this connecting using start tls option and then you have to enter your username or either you can say your email address from which you are going to send the mail and then after you have to enter your password right now the password fields are disabled because i already stored my password inside the ignition okay now you can uh, save the changes and you can go to ignition designer launcher okay so we will go back and then we will open our ignition designer launcher you can see here i have created some basic screen to send the mail okay now here i have three fields this is the text field one okay you can see here text field one this is the text field and this is the text area and this is my button okay now whatever i write in the text field one it goes as a subject of my mail whatever i write in the text field that goes to the receiver of my mail okay it means if i write anything here that means my script will send the mail to this person okay and then after body what you want to write in your mail okay now how this is going to use in my script so if i double click on this button you can see event handlers action and then action perform in action perform i have do some scripting okay so subject so what this will do is this will go to this text field one to get the subject okay as you can see text field one okay even dot source dot parent dot get component text field one and then it will fetch the text whatever i write inside this okay same for my body and my body comes from text area this is my text area okay and my recipients so whatever email address i will write here in my text field that goes to as a recipient okay and if i want to send the multiple emails then i can split them by comma okay now system.net.send email and which smtp profile you want to use so outlook email profile from address from address means from which email address you want to send the mail okay so fusion underscore automate at the rate outlook dot in and what the subject okay so subject is already available here so we have to pass the parameter here same as body and same as recipients okay so we will press okay to save this and then we will go to our ignition designer launcher and we will save our project and then we will go to tools and then we will launch our project in full screen mode now 
what we will do is we will go to our browser and then we will see there is no new email in my inbox okay now we will go to our vision client project okay now we have to log in so admin and my password okay so whatever i write in this text field one that goes to as a subject of my mail so this is the test mail from ignition scara okay now who is the receiver so this is my email address okay so this is the receiver and what is my body and this is test body okay and we will press this button so when you hover the mouse you can see the color is changing okay so when i press this button the color remains same even if i hover the mouse so it means that is processing something okay now as, as you can see now color is changing little bit so it means the background process is completed now we will again go to our mail and you can see we have got the mail fusion underscore automate this is the test mail from ignition scara so this is our subject which i have given here now if i open this mail you can see fusion underscore automate at the red outlook dot in okay so this is my email address from and this is to it means my email address i mean user email from whom we are going to send the mail okay and this is my body if i want to send the multiple emails okay then how can i do that so again we go to this and then we will uh, enter another email address for another user so pi underscore lean underscore outlook dot com so here i have two user ng dot innovative at the gmail dot com and then pi underscore lean at the rate outlook dot com okay so my mail goes to this two person so again i press the button to send mail so my button is in processing okay so now it is released now i'll get another mail okay see the second mail is here now as you can see in two we have two persons sorry in two we have two persons piling at the rate outlook.com and ng innovative at the rate outlook.com in my previous mail only i have one person in the two okay so this is how you can send email to multiple users from your ignition scara okay so this is the subject this is the receiver who is going to receive your mails and this is the body from uh, whatever you write want to write in your body you can write it here and whenever you press this button your mail is go okay so this is how you can send email from your ignition scara project so here i have used the vision client project you can also do the same in igni uh, perspective client project okay so if you have any question related to that you can ask me and here is the whole steps what you have to do in your gateway configuration then which field is which one and what is the python scripting inside the button okay so you can see action action perform and what scripting i have done and uh, you can copy the scripting and paste it inside your button okay so if you have any question related to that then you can ask me in the comment section or you can send the mail okay also you can send the text message on our telegram okay so we will meet you in the next video till then take care goodbye and thank you